Hey folks, it's Jumping Quills, and welcome back to more Kingdoms and Castles for your viewing enjoyment and my playing pleasure. Now, this is part 20, or part 30 of our Cheerio Return series. And well, last we left off, we pretty much finished up working on this wonderful little, uh, I guess new kind of area. We haven't finished, we're nearly finished, I should say. I'm going to put in another pretty much blacksmith right in here. And that's going to be pretty much all... Sure, he did not even set a chance while he flew in and got them as decimated. Um, pretty much just going to go ahead and hopefully in the future put a great library in there. That should help a lot with the happiness. Um, but then again, happiness is also really nice. We did finally manage to decrease the... Um, sorry, what's the word? We did finally manage to decrease the taxes from a 20 to 50%. Just to show you what the difference was, if I were to raise it back up, we'd probably have 700 gold a turn, or a, a year. But I don't want to tax my citizens anymore. I mean, we were doing that early on, but I think we'll be able to get away with enough having that 15% tax. Um, it'll dispose this bunch of new housing to go in down this area, which should be relatively okay. As well as this massive area down here being relatively um, left alone to be pretty much farming. Uh, what I am going to do here, actually, I don't think I'm going to do fishing villages down here. It doesn't make much sense. I might do it down this way, but definitely not over here. I think what I'll do is actually have a secured wall on the outsides. So a lot of these interior areas here aren't going to be, like, walled off, like, completely walled off as districts, like I've done here. Probably do some segmenting walls, um, but overall nothing bad. Because I would like to build on the piers inside of here, but outside, at the moment, it doesn't seem like the best choice to make. So I'd rather just keep it to be fisheries and just have it stay at that. Um, so I'll have like little fishing docks and stuff built on the outside and that kind of stuff. So if I am going to do anything, it might just be like a singular row of docks um, out here. But that's to be determined. Uh, but what I'm definitely going to do is order the cut down of pretty much all of these trees. Not all of these trees, just the ones on the coastline. And I would like to get those cut down and... I want to keep working on this little area over here, make sure that this farm area is going to be nice. I do need to balance out building out the farm area with improving the housing area down here. New housing area, I should say, down this way. Um, and to do that, I mean, these guys are going to need a market down here. They need a lot of stuff. They will be in range of this nice cathedral and stuff, uh, so that's not going to be too terrible. But I need to get the town... Uh, I need to get taverns up and running. I got to get new housing in this area. There's a lot of stuff we got to get done. Uh, and to do this, I think I'm actually going to see if I can try to run an aqueduct through the wall. Um, I'm going to try to run this aqueduct through the wall here and bring it out to where it kind of just connects to the town square. Right there, I hope we should have more than enough range. The Noria pretty much isn't even connected to anything. Um, so we definitely should have the range for that. But I'll get the reservoir in here. I'm going to put a, a nice little, uh, I can think of the word down. Uh, well, a uh, fountain down. I think what I am going to do actually is stick a... I'm going to stick a manor in there. I think I said I was going to put a library in right there. I completely forgot about that. I'll probably have to put another one in as well as this area. Um, but at least to start, I think what I'm going to do... Do I want to run... A, I think I do. I would like to run a garden from here to here. And as a result, I think I'll stick... I'm going to stick a fountain. I'm gonna, where is the fountain? Why can't I find the fountain? I'm going to stick a fountain right here. Um, maybe I put a clinic and a library in there. And just kind of leave most of this area for housing. Um, these gardens don't have complete range. So I think I'll also just do this. Let's see. How do I want to do this? If I could ever find the stuff I'm looking for. I'll do that. I'll probably stick in... What's the range on this? Probably stick a well right there then. Or another fountain right here. Um, I can do two manners there. Oh, I need to leave room for a freaking tavern. I'll do that on this side, it doesn't matter. Uh, we need to also get other stuff built in here. God, there's a lot of stuff I need to do. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff I do need to do, actually. I don't know, I kind of realize it. 
Um, hmm. Okay, that's actually built, so let's just go ahead and keep getting this stuff underway before the trees re regrow and I forget about it. I'm trying to really just balance out where I'm placing things here. So I'm gonna do that with those walls. It shouldn't be the end. It shouldn't be the end if I do that, do that with those walls. And how do I want to do this? If I do that, I could stick in. I think I could stick in. Uh, yeah, I could do that actually. This one's a bad idea. I think what I'll do here. Put just a basic well down since it doesn't need to be anything fancy. I'm gonna go ahead, stick two charcoal makers down here. And I'm also gonna stick some more swine herds. You can fit another three in this one little block here. Perfect. And that should be more than enough. I just really don't have like any water coverage. Uh, I think this one row, yeah, we can sacrifice a single row. I'll do that, get a well on there. As for, how are we doing on food? Somehow still in the negatives, which surprises me. I don't know how that works. But yeah, definitely still a lot more we can do with food. And like, I'm not really, I'm not too worried about it. I can just turn pretty much this whole area into food as well, need be, or into farmland. I'll probably stick down here to making it and I'll, I'll mix it up eventually, just not now. So I got that being built, uh, that built up. I have this built. Where did you just destroy a castle? Oh my god, you guys are ridiculous with this. <laughs> they just, why did you need to smash that open? Freaking, I, I don't get it. I don't, I don't, why? Why? What possesses you to be such assholes? That, that's just all these ogres are, they're just fucking dicks. I don't get them. Like, thanks for being assholes, I guess. I, I don't know. Uh, uh oh. They actually have a lot of ogres on that stack. Are we gonna be able to stop that in time? Ooh, we were able to stop the stack in time. Okay. Why are they just staying there? I'm gonna lose that forester. Oh, that's no, that's a single hobble, that's right. I mean, they lost a lot of people. This freaking. Wait, did they attack Esler? No, it's just literally all over here. I... Please. Please, what did my walls do to you? Leave my walls alone, you fucking assholes. I just... I hate these things. I hate these fucking... Oh, I really hate... I really do hate these freaking ogres. They they just went out of their way to destroy as many freaking castle walls as possible. That what that, Those are just assholes. That's all there. Oh my god, okay. Well, let's see. Down here, I need to get stockpiles, taverns up. Um, I just realized they won't have a. I don't think they're gonna have that neighbor bonus. Oh, they do have neighbors. Okay, good. Uh, tavern. Where do I wanna put the tavern? I'll stick it right there. Three were kidnapped, you don't say. Um. Let's double check. What do they say? I just need to put a stockpile down here. It's probably nice. So, I don't know where the stockpile is. There we go. Do a little big stockpile. They've got the nice... What is happening? They're just destroying as many walls as they possibly can. How annoying. Do I want to put... Mm. One, two, three, four. I'm probably gonna do the same thing I did here. Make this like one area super big. Uh, so that third block is actually only just one up. It's from there, I think that's a three increase and two increase. So I'll do one up there. One, two, three. I'll just do that for now. I don't know if that's tall enough. Definitely not. I can't really tell at the moment. I mean, this will definitely be bigger. I think this one's bigger than the walls. Actually, this is that's the same as a basic four tall wall. So if this is one up, this will be two. 
Actually, it might be perfect. I have no idea. I'll just see where that goes. So do that there. I don't know how I want to do this just yet. I'm just going to clear cut more of this, more of these trees down. I don't need them up. Ah, I don't know what I want to do there. For over here, that's relatively fine. Again, we could, we're doing fine on food. I think we're doing fun on food. We just need more fruits, I think, to be made. So we'll keep this area down here pretty much just labeled to foods or to orchard production and hybrid production. Uh, speaking of roads, I'm going to do this. Uh, actually, no, I shouldn't have done that. Hold on. Let's cancel. Bring it down one more. Cancel that and then bring it like this. And then, I'll probably do the same thing, actually. Except this is going to be a little bit different. And let's we'll do that. Yeah, let's we'll do that. Get those roads built out. All that clear cutting has been done, Jesus. Wowza. I mean, that's got a pretty good range. I think the Cathedral or the Great Library will hit most of that, too. Still somehow in the negatives for the housing, or the, we're losing money each year. Uh, don't know what's going on there. What happens if I tidy them? Oh, I just donate them. What does the what does that do for the church? What? Do, what does? I how does that help me? Does that make them like? I doesn't give them any bonuses. I don't know what that is. That's weird. Okay. That is certainly strange. Oh, I do need a church down here, actually. Like a normal church, too. Uh, so if I'm going to do that, I think let's do it like this. Run the road. Finish it off like that. Uh, stick a nice little church in right here. Because churches don't need payment, apparently. I don't know why, but they don't. That's just a little weird to me. Probably sticking in a little... Mm, no, I don't need it. Is that tall enough? I can't tell if it was the same height. I mean, I do... I just... So if this is three... That's four. That's two higher than that. So that is the definite right amount. Or is it not? No, it's not. No, it's short. We need to raise them both up by one, I think. There we go. So do that. And then I think what I'll do is to give us some more money to actually build some proper defenses. I'll probably actually just bite the bolt on this. They won't have access to the things just yet, but I'll do this. Uh... I should do this. It'll be interesting with the design if I do it like this. Do that and that. Stick in a cottage. And stick in another cottage here. And then stick in a nice little uh Oh they need a market. That's what I haven't put down here. They do need a market down here. Do that. We'll do that and then stick a nice little hollow one. That little block there. It should help. Right? Yeah, it should help. If I, you know, I'll just I'll just full send in the area right now, why not? We full send this shit, that's what we're doing. I'll do that. I do need to get a market in, I think that's what I'm building right there. If I do do it if I do want to do a statue here, um it wouldn't be a terrible idea. It would have an effect on Almost. It would give us a pretty good effect radius. I think we do have a dragon one built nearby, so I'm going to build this Lord Levi here. There we go. Dragons have been sighted. You don't say. One, I already heard one hit the ground, I think. Yeah. This guy might actually cause some damage here. Just because we don't have a whole lot of cover. I say that and he just gets absolutely demolished. Fantastic. So all that new housing will hopefully give us some more room. Oh my god, we're so close. Wait, this will give us another... 
Wait, will this give us enough? Oh, we're going to be able to get more than 3,000? We're so close. Oh my god, that's actually so great. So these guys should hopefully now be actually able to get some stuff. And they have to go... I mean, food has to go really far from there to get down here just to fill up that market. So I won't expand this area out too much more. I don't think that's going to work out too well for me if I do do that. But what I will do is I'll probably keep working on the food area. Actually, let's, let's plot this out real quick. I did need to change some of this into uh, some fish land. So I'll do... I'm just going to do a gate here. And these gates are really just going to be put in. I'm not going to turn them into ballista gates, I don't think. I might maybe down the line, but not immediately. So I'm going to do this. I'll do another gate there. I'm going to order the construction of fishing huts here and here. Uh, then I'm going to order the... I don't want to cut down too many trees, so I'll do this. No, wait, no, I don't cancel that one. Oops. Cancel that order. Can I not cancel that order? I don't think I can cancel the order. Okay. Oh, well. And then what I'm going to do is run a nice little road down like that. Pretty much one directly to here. Once that's all, once this is all cut down, I'll run it along this way. And let's see what else. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get it done, people. Get it done. Get her done! I'll do that, connect the road like this. I do need to find out where I want to stick the foresters in here. If I were to do the forester here, would it be bad? I think that would be good. And maybe actually right here would be good. I think we'll do that. But to do that, I need to run a road to it. And cut down, I think, like this tree here. This tree there. That should work. Water coverage in the area is not the best. I will fully admit that. There we go. If I'm going to do more water, I'm probably going to stick a Noria right here. And try to run it up into this area to irrigate it. Because I don't think this one can reach down there with the swine farms in the way. Let's see. I do actually might want to cut down perhaps just like one more tree. So order the construction of that, get the forester built. There's a door to the forester, I can never tell. Do that, and we'll do that. So that should be good enough for the foresters, it'll help us out a little bit. The reason I'm constructing, ordering the construction of that is to do a fishmonger in here as well as do one just kind of right next to it as well. So do that for the uh, two fishing cuts. And as we go further down this way, we'll of course expand the fishing cut ranges. Um, but I think for now this should be relatively okay. Maybe I should have pushed this out one more. Actually, yeah, let's, let's push that out one more. I'd like to, I'd like that to be a little bit further out. Um, so if it was right there, I'm just gonna stick it right there. And we'll have to do uh, we wouldn't have to do up here. Uh, we might as well just do up here. Why not? It wouldn't hurt. A bridge would probably just be more efficient, but I want to get the pier in. And just, just in the future, if I ever do decide to do something with this stuff, I don't know. Well, this is looking good. Look at that big old dragon sitting in the middle of the road down there. This is looking good. It's looking nice. This would be the biggest farming area we have. That's like not divided by walls. I mean, honestly, we pretty much have farms. Where did our first farm start? I forget, where was it even our, our first farms are right here, that's right. And our first farm was built over here. I think we built this area next. Yeah, we built this area next. I'm trying to remember how we built this in order. We went from here to here. I think we went up here. Or maybe we went over here. I don't even know. That's just crazy to think. Wow, that's really weird. Okay. Yeah, these foresters will eventually get to working. Again, a lot of people need jobs, and this area will provide a lot of jobs. But I don't think there's going to be enough jobs for us to be able to supply come the end of this little series, so I don't know. 
Uh, we have a stockpile there. This area is relatively okay for happiness. I think so. They should have access to... My only concern is them getting access to all their food, which it looks like they're getting, so it doesn't worry me too much then. Taxes are going back up. I would like to get some more taxes before I start building stuff, just in case. Then again, I don't really know. The next Viking attack is in one year. I get the feeling we're going to get hit pretty hard over this area. Again, a lot of our weakest points are pretty much this entire zone. So we just don't have any coverage. But that's only so much you can do about it. At least over here is looking relatively okay. Uh, to... Wait, no, I think I fucked that up. Cancel one of those. For now, I'm just going to designate these as parts of the wall. I'm not going to really work on those parts just yet. I think for food, we're doing relatively good. Somehow in the negatives, but I never really trust that. We lost, oh, we lost 351 to exposure. So I think it's because we actually don't have enough to store food. So we need more butchers, actually, is what we need. Um, I don't know if butchers leave a smell. Do they? It stores up to 100 pork. To multiple servings. Hmm. If we do want to do butchers, we might just want to stick it down this area somewhere. And frankly, I feel like I'm more inclined to do them like that. I don't know if that's going to be the best choice, but I'll, I guess we'll figure that out. I want to move that well over one, to be honest. Vikings are attacking from the north. What? Uh, not a surprise. I don't... I'm gonna, I'll let that play out. I'm just gonna double check we're not getting hit from anywhere else. Not all from the north. I'm glad I'm able to bait that area out. These guys are cutting down trees super fast. Like, this used to be covered in trees, I think, at some point, and we just demolished it. Okay, as soon as they plant a tree, just like, it gets cut down. But they're doing their job, at least. They're working. We're still hauling wood back and forth from the <laughs> clear cutting we did earlier. As for over here, relatively okay, I think. Bathhouses are too crowded, you don't say. Okay, well, I might just have to bite the bullet on that one then. And just build a bathhouse. So get that bathhouse built, which should help. Vikings were destroyed in the recent invasion. Well, we're still not clear. Look at that little blob of Vikings go, Jesus Christ. Poor foresters, they can never catch a break. Have we, have we, re have we hit over a three thousand? Have we not? Okay, I gotta hold a festival. I gotta figure that out. We need a festival. Get me that three thousand. I want that three thousand. That's what I want. My God, beautiful though. I need to get more housing in. It's just such a struggle because if I get more housing, I have to. Oh, it's just it's rough. Okay, what I will do. I will put some more quarries down here. Do I even need the stone? Like, honestly, is there... I don't know if I need the stone. I feel like I'd just, I'd be better off... We're making 200, that's a lot a year. Like, I don't think I need any more. I really don't think I need any more. This would be the last thing we'd have to harvest, but... I mean, like, it's just... Don't, I don't think I need it. I... It's a questionable choice. But I just don't think it's needed. Because, like, stone isn't something that you have any pass about. Like, you just continue to store stone. And so, you know, because of that, I add she... I'm just gonna rock and move it. I'd rather do that, to be honest. So at least if I do that, it'd be a little bit safer. Uh, that bathhouse is built. That's probably hemorrhage some of our gold. A little bit. But I think that's also improved happiness in this. Oh my god, it's so bright green. Christ almighty, that is bright green. <sighs> wow. I mean, like, I'm glad my people are getting happier. That's great to see. I think we just need to get a bathhouse, like, up in here. So, like, if we get that bathhouse in here, we should be pretty good. Let's just double check the range of this. Yeah, because, I mean, this extends... It's like just these guys who don't have the bathhouse, which sucks for them. So yeah, we've, we've dug up that one bit of stone there. I think that was the best call for me to make. Just don't know if it was really worth it to keep it around. 
Um, maybe I do want to. I might just have to bite the bullet in these new areas and just keep like building stuff. If I am gonna do, what would I need to put here? What do I need to put? Then they, they would have access to neighbors. They live right across the street from the manors. If I could do another cottage right in there, it wouldn't be too terrible. And I might as well just stick another tavern down. My only concern for this area is just them getting enough food. That's really all I'm concerned about. Uh, range of this. If I can do a fountain, I might as well do a fountain. Stick a fountain in there. I don't think I need to put any more stuff down. We have a space of three that I wouldn't know what to do with here, to be honest. Probably won't do anything with it. I might do like a small market. Yeah, I think I'll do this, actually. If I do... Another tavern's up and running. I'm gonna stick a small, just a small market right there. And probably stick a small stockpile. I don't know what else I'd even put there. No idea. Maybe a third tower even there, right next to it. Who knows? I might just do a baker down there. I don't think anyone would be upset smelling freshly baked bread in the morning. So fuck it. I'll do a baker. Why not? They're a little bit far away, but what are you going to do? Food? Looking pretty good. We're losing a lot to exposure, so actually we're in the pluses, but we never have enough fish. Fish is not a uh, good source. It's just never really like... I got fish is just not good. I don't know how you're supposed to actually have fish be like a viable thing of food. I just don't know. Like, por like it, pork is just constantly better. Fish compared to pork is just like why even bother with it. I don't know. Oh god, we're only three minutes away from finishing. Jeez, that's not okay. I need more time. Give me more time, please. I gotta get more houses built. So I think what I'm gonna do with this area. Probably gonna do. I'm gonna order all that. Let's get all that construction up. I don't know how I want to divide the walls just yet. I don't know if it's even safe to. But I'm gonna order the clear cutting of all this as well. So I think what I would like to do is with this is probably actually have a big old wall run along that. Maybe bring this up to here too. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do actually. Do all of that. I'm gonna order your pretty much the construction of this wall here for now. I'm gonna run this pretty much down. Let's see. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm just gonna get all this cut down so I can get this these walls down. So I'll do this. And once this is done, we'll be good. A lot of construction that needs to be done. But I'll put... Uh, I guess we could just do that technically. I wouldn't need to. I'll delete like this wall like here. And as well as like this one or something. And in their places, I'll just put castle gates. Or castle towers. That'll be relatively okay. I will leave this open. I'll leave this area open. I'm not going to build walls up to it. Um... Or actually, you know what? Do I need to do that? I don't know if these two spaces are necessary, because I've done something similar here. And I might as well leave some space open. So maybe I'll bring it in. Maybe like, just two spaces, two, three spaces, yeah. That's, that's, that looks good enough. I think here I will have a legitimate wall. Like an actual connecting wall. I don't know if I'm going to do the same past this. I don't quite know. I really don't know, actually. But I guess I'll figure that out for in, in later episodes. God, we're making such good progress. It's crazy. It really is. We'll put a lot more housing in here, hopefully. Probably have to put in another cathedral somewhere down here or there. Maybe over this way or this way. I don't know. We'll see where that comes, where where that comes, where that goes. But yeah, God, this is beautiful. We can do pretty much a road along this way. Yeah, that actually works out pretty well if I do it like this. Can't really order the construction of all the road, but almost in all of it. There we go. And you know what? Since that's gonna be the gate here, let's just do this. 
We'll do that for now. So that works. Actually, I might as well just finish up the room. Yeah, fuck it. Just completely divide it into quadrants. Beautiful. Okay, yeah. I like what we're doing. We're making progress. I wasn't sure what I was going to do, but I mean, it's come along nicely. This whole area's been finished up. I mean, we got pretty much, we're working on this one now. We have the ever-expanding farming area, which will probably go all the way down to here. Maybe even do a little bit more down this way if we need to do it, but I guess we'll see. But yeah, I am over now, folks, so I hope you have enjoyed this episode. We're getting near the end of, I think, this series, because once we have built entirely upon this continent, I probably will end the series, just to put it out there. I don't know what else I'd do. Maybe try to get, you know, up to 5,000 people if I can, but I guess we'll see where we go with that. But yeah, other than that, folks, I have nothing else for this video. If you like what you saw and you want to see more in the future, you know what to do. This has been Jumpy Quills, and I'll see you folks in the next one.